Today, we are actually at Barb's house for Christmas. No, we're not, we're not really here for Christmas, <laughs> but we are going to take a look at what her Christmas display is. And then after that, you will see also some footage from my house this year. But uh, I'm just gonna flat out and tell you this is better. Like, look at the, like, look. <laughs> like, she has way more Christmas than I do. My favorite. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So we're gonna take a look around and you can just see all of her different collections because she has a variety of vintage Christmas stuff. So I guess we can start over here with the Russian department. Looks like a department store blew up. <laughs> and I know not all of these are Russians. Right, um, well, Russians were made in Atlanta, Georgia, and this type right here, this is actually, I think this is the, what is on my shelf? One of the kids put a toy there. Um, this, a nail. <laughs> <laughs> this is um, one of the first, uh, I think that's the first Russian I got. And then the ones with these type of like stitched boots like that, from mm -hmm. what I know, they were made in the late 50s, like around 1957 oh, wow. they started. And then you have some, and they went up through at least the early 70s, I think. Oh. At least the early 70s. Well, some of them have candy canes. Others are not as lucky. Oh, that's true, yeah. Well, <laughs> we tried to give, give them all. The kids probably stole a couple. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, and I've got my new rainbow of Rushtons that I didn't have. The only one I had last year was the blue one that you gave me a couple years ago. And yeah. I was lucky enough to get some others this year. Right. You've got like all the colors and you have a, like a, you have different ethnicities. Yep. Uh huh. What do they, what other ethnicities are there? Like, no, is none it? None that I know of. Okay. So we've got that one, like literally all the rest of them in their colors. What other colors of suits though do you need? Well, I need, there's a gold and he's kind of a bigger. So size. that's mustard. So there's yeah. an actual gold there's one. like a shiny gold and uh -huh. there's a shiny silver. Oh. Um, there is a like darker royal blue. Mm -hmm. um, there's there's variations on the suits too. So there might be like, say I have a blue one, but I might someday see like one in a velvety blue suit. Something okay. like that. Okay, so yeah, it, it, you just never know because it's just <laughs> one of <Yeah>. those things. <laughs> but this is crazy. Just seeing this evolve. It, it, this was a new apparatus this year too. The, yes, the, the shelf. <laughs> yeah. Like if I had an extra couch, I think I'd probably like to pile them all on the couch or something, you know, but for oh this year, I was like, well, I mean. I'm right, happy. I don't think people would be able to set them. Right, that's <laughs> what I mean, if I had an extra couch. <laughs> so over here, I know there's a giant ceramic Christmas tree. Now, I have a few ceramic tr Christmas trees. You, we have about the same amount, but I know Aaron really wants one like that too. Yes. A yes. large one, and they're hard to find. I tried to get a really large one recently uh -huh. and it sold on the auction for $500. And that oh was my a gosh. global auction. $500. See, these trees are going for a lot. But yeah, this is a really good one. Nice, large ceramic tree. I don't, I, that's like over, it's about two feet or more. I think so, yeah. Yeah. Maybe 26, that's just a guess. Yeah. And you've got your little uh, blow mold, some blow molds. That's a hard plastic. Yep, I could have lit those up, but. I didn't, I forgot. I think we have the same candlesticks. Do we? Probably. I think. I just realized, I think of things I forgot to get out like every day. I just realized I didn't get out my other little um, uh, antique tins. I only got one. Do you have Christmas tins? Oh, yeah. like the uh, tin deco? Yeah. All right, and here's some more of the ceramic trees. You have a good selection of them. We have. Yeah, I I'd like, like another white one. With the you know, whites I finally on there. got one white one and I'd like to find it. I want one of the big white and gold lava trees is what I really like. <gasps> so I just went to a place and they had the lava, the volcano tree, but it was, I think it was like 200 something and yeah. it had a crack, but it was like cracked on That's the back. That's the same thing. I had seen one somewhere yeah. and it was that much and it was repaired. And I wasn't going to do it. No. I if, if it was in pristine shape, I would have paid 200 something for it. Yeah. But you have like a little putz guy yep. there. I, I do like the little putz people. I, I know you have do. more. I think you should do those. Yeah, I know you have more on the other cabinet as well. There's yes, there's another cabinet, um, and these are fun. I've I've always liked the Noel people too. This one has got a not that great of a repair, but that was fifty uh -huh. cents at a yard sale. <laughs> oh gosh, yeah, like and no one just glancing at that's gonna even. Right. I didn't. I wouldn't have known because you have so much of it. <laughs> I, my, yeah. 
Oh. This, this has actually been sitting here like this all year since That's, last year. It's true. <laughs> I don't want to put it away and it's like it's work to pack it up and it I just like it so it's there. Yeah well the trees they weren't there. No. Not oh the and your paint by number wall that keeps moving around. I just got that up about <laughs> an hour ago. Oh yeah I, I, only had one up. I do like that together. I have a lot I have more winter ones but I just haven't figured out where to put them all at the moment but <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna do that wall and then I had another plan, but we can't find what I wanted to put on that wall, so. Well, you could take down those people. I could put that <laughs> over there and then I could do those, the paintings over there, that would be. Really though, since it's a rail, you could put them just right in front of them, oh, temporarily. Yeah. And then so, cause if you have big ones and then it would just, and then once you, they just pull them down. Yeah. Um, you got your little stockings hung by the yeah. staircase with care. <laughs> as the song doesn't go. <laughs> uh, and then it extends over here so well. Oh, I, we kind of brushed upon it, but you do have an aluminum tree up there. Oh, yes. And that one you recently got, I thought, right? Uh-huh. And that one I wanted because I needed one to put up there so that our cat would not be able to yeah. get it. Yeah, I've heard that actually the cats are the aluminum there is a problem. When I was getting it out, she was really into it, yeah. Well, like they're um, bad for their health or something. Oh, really? That's what I heard. Well, she was really attracted to it and No, she, not allowed. But yeah, so that's a smaller aluminum. So that's your, you've got a larger aluminum tree and then that one. Yes. See, she has everything more. I just have one tree at home. Well, you you've had got more, you just chose two. to- That's right, I, <laughs> that's right. You're a collector more so than anything else. <laughs> I am definitely not. So, over here a ton of like there's just so many nice things you've sold this the okay. cookie guy yes i did sell one yeah and then i kept one all the ceramics now for a while all right well that's another collection see the winking santa mugs well i got that all together <laughs> at a rummage sale oh gosh so i was i thought about selling it and i thought i would keep it at least for this year so. and you have like a scotch tin Oh yes, the new collection of little bells. Oh yeah. That mm -hmm. apparently. There's a couple more down there. <laughs> yeah. See, that's my uh, my speed because they're so small. Yes. And you can kind of just like you know collect them, and it doesn't really take a lot of space. And then we've got like the dream pets. They are always fun. Mm -hmm. And these go well with the putts houses too because they have that natural. They have that well, that natural. The uh, like the gl well, there's glitter on them. Yeah. And they kind of have that homemade handmade look to them oh boy and the little soldier boy those are napkin rings oh yes yeah i i really could have done more with this i i more get out well what i mean is i could have arranged some things differently but i was going to get out all my night before christmas books and line them up somehow on the top and how many do you have i don't know that's another reason i should get them all so out. that's one that yeah. one looks familiar to me i think i got that from you okay that's, <laughs> that's why <laughs> yeah okay but yeah i would think you'd probably have six of them i don't know i, I don't know probably six you do some sneaky six, things eight. on ebay and i don't know about it so. i don't buy too many of those on ebay but <laughs> And then even up there, you've got a little Putz House collection. Yeah, I was kind of lazy with this area. I didn't want to take all my glass and put it away because, well, I didn't. Why? You don't need to. It, so I just kind of added little things in there. I mean, red and green and blue. <laughs> they're all Christmas colors. And orange. <laughs> yeah, orange isn't really Christmas, but the majority of it is. Yeah. That's a nice tree. I like it. looks yeah. really old. I got that, and the lady at the store didn't know that it worked. I think she would have priced it higher if she did. <laughs> Yikes. But. Oh, this was from a subscriber last year. Mm -hmm. yeah. I have a flamingo version of that. So this is supposed to be like your dog, uh -huh. Gus. <laughs> oh, and then you have more on the table over here too. Oh, yes. Oh, you have a Murano. Well, it's, I don't think it's Murano. These are the oh. two that I, that you didn't look at yet to see if you might want. I like <laughs> that one. But this one does have a problem. Though. I don't like problems. <laughs> no. <laughs> What's the problem? Um. Well, where did it go? That's a I like the colors tremendous. I know there's a problem. It was only twelve dollars because of the problem. Oh, wait, it Here spins it on its base. It oh no, the whole thing. No, I was spinning. Oh. <laughs> See, it's got a broken oh, limb. Oh, broken limb. It's very heavy, but it's not. They usually are. It's not all the way clear. See, so I don't think it's. Oh, wrong. there's a there's a sticker residue there too. Yep. The color's so pretty. Yeah, I thought it was worth. So $12. sad about it being broken. I don't know. I have to think about that. I really do like the color. Yeah. And that's from Target. 
Yes, that was from uh, Michael. The oh, cult, the cult of vintage. He put that in my package. It was a, it was a freebie. <laughs> and then the Snoopies. Yeah, they do a whole thing. Who does? All of them, but I don't know if we need that on there. It's up to you. Need they, what? Where? They do music and lights. Is what oh. They do. It's a Hallmark thing that my mother-in-law gave me a few years ago. I think ago. we could use our imagination. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so. Oh, and that's I've got a couple. Pretty. This is a little toothpick. musical tree, and then this I really like. I just stuck Christmas cards in there, but he's oh, you musical can't put toothpicks too. In. I don't know what I was thinking. I you was can thinking stick toothpicks with, with cheese, cheese cubes on. That'd that's... be fun. And then it's been around. But I thought light was supposed to. You can put lights in so there. So your yeah. your cheese is lit up. I actually <laughs> I had <laughs> I had the little lights in there, but I stole them off of there to use for something else. So. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah, it's just so. I just the, the the furniture in here is so good with everything because you're you're really heavy into the mid century, and but not actual mid century, just no. the style for the furniture. Because is this Joybird? I forget. No, or that was some other. I went with a cheaper one. Yeah, because I was just afraid of it getting messed up, spending that much on the more expensive one. So yeah, and that's not even a real cat. That's a stuffed ant. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> with as as lifeless as it is. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> hello, hi, hello, hi, hello, hi, hi there. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so uninterested. Oh yeah, and then I love the Afghan because it reminds me of a Christmas tree. Mm -hmm. Like that's always nice. And then look, two more of them little things right there, and they're just coming out of of everywhere, really. Out of this big, oh, I like this. This was a new thing you've got. Yes, that's that's a early 1900s. Um, this is good. It would have been like, a, it's called Fairbanks Fairy Soap. So it was a display in like, you know, probably general stores back then. And you just got to fill oh, it up. Oh, felt down. He uh -oh. didn't hold his little thing right. Oh, he's over there pouting in the corner. <laughs> is that on purpose? <laughs> he's like, oh, no. <laughs> that is sad. Hmm. Yeah, but you have room in there. So I guess you got to get more. I could, yeah. <laughs> I don't get that type as often. They have to be a good deal for me to want those. <laughs> are those Harold Gale? Some of them are, and some are made in Japan. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, is there is that room done up too, or no, is it just a tree? No, that's just the tree in there. So um, that's where we've had our main tree because we weren't sure what the cat would do, and that ah. way we could have closed the door if she was going to climb it, <laughs> but she didn't. So. Okay. What is that goober over there doing? Oh, he's just hanging around. He falls over all the time. His head falls off. And... He looks a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> like he's not all there. He was just looking for a place to go. Yeah. And I got that big reindeer the other day at an auction. <laughs> oh, is that old? That can't be old. Is it's, it? It's really? It's, um, I kind would of say me 70s or 80s would be my guess. Oh, wow. Yeah. So, I guess it's Rudolph. I didn't really need a reindeer, but he was only like, I think I got him for $6. <laughs> That's the story of your life. I didn't really need. Right. I didn't really need anything, but then my whole living room happened and <laughs> here we are. All right, so we're gonna start right over here, which is really the main event for our Christmas setup. So we do have the aluminum tree right in the middle there. And it also is on a rotating base, but I do not have it plugged in. So the entire tree would spin, but it's just not something that we're doing this year. So I have the aluminum tree with all of the ornaments on it. We'll do a little bit of a close up. So all of these are the, well, most of these are the handmade ones that are made with like the foam core. And then you would take the sequence and the little beads and put them on there. So we've got those. And then we've got other ones like this. This is a jewel bright ornament. But down below, I have a little bit of a Christmas village. Now this was part of my uh, grandma's display and these are some of them that I decided to keep but I sold like the vast majority of them because I just did not need 10 times this amount of houses so I just have this small assortment I basically chose my favorite ones out of there so we've got like a little train depot we've got a nice house back there we've got an, a really pretty barn I think the barn is my favorite it looks like the most the best one really the quality is nice and then there's this little covered bridge and then we have some of the trees so that's this area and then right over here on the mantle itself I have the ceramic trees and we have just this many I think we'd like to get one more of them but 
honestly, I don't think it would even fit, but we do. We would like one like really large one. So I have, now this one here is my grandma's ceramic tree. And so I was able to get that. I was really lucky because there's a lot of grandchildren and uh, well, I have four aunts and uncles. So um, I didn't ask for a lot, but that was one thing that I really wanted. And I'm glad to get it. So I was able to get that. And then um, actually some of these I just picked up. Aaron's grandma's tree is the one on the end over there. So it's more of just like a one color in the green right there. And there's a little plastic popcorn guy back there too. And then we have some of these smaller ones. I do like these too because they have like the white and the green on there. And then here are some of the putts houses that I have with the little snowman and that one. There's a little jazzy guy, an angel, another one. There's like a something back there. I have all this fake snow, which works really well because we have all these cords, so it kind of helps hide the, all the cords for all of these. There's just so many of them. And then we have another plastic popcorn decoration back there. So this is the tree area, and this is nicely displayed on the fireplace. We also have the spotlights on the top, and those are LED color changing bulbs. I have them set to twinkle, and they go from green to red, but they're really pretty. That's just one setting, but I can also make them blue. Hey Google, make the fireplace blue. And then we'll watch them turn to blue. The blue is really pretty effect as well. So now we're gonna go right over here to the TV where I have more items. I have some of our trees. I have some gla glass trees. This was a ceramic wreath which used to go on the mantle with the trees, but it, we ran out of room. So that doesn't, it's not, no longer over there. It does light up, but I don't have it lit up this year. <laughs> and then we have some other fun things. This, I like this, the Noel Santa with the reindeer. That's really fun. Oh, this is a Joseph original dog. It doesn't, it's not supposed to be Stella, but it's kind of similar. So we've got those, and then we've got these. This is an interesting piece right here, but it's kind of falling apart. I picked it up a few years ago, but all the reindeer, they're, they're having issues. But that's, that's really pretty. And then we've got a Lefton sugar dish right there. This is made by Miro Star, uh, yes, Miro Star out of New Jersey. And you don't, I don't see them very often, but they have this aluminum on there. They're very cool, it does light up. And I have another one that is lit up I can show you. I have the, these, these are the candles, very similar to Barb's, the blow mold can, candles. And then I have this kind of haphazardly thrown together over here. But my other grandma, so now my, I've been through three different grandmas now. Um, these are our, our stockings that she made. So we were able to get those whenever that time came. And so I have mine and Aaron's. And I, I, didn't, I, for, I kind of forgot that she'd even made him one, but uh, yeah, so he has one and, and we have already been through our stockings. We, we tend to do that early every year. Oh, Stella. I think she wants to be on the camera. And there she is. Oh, Stella. Now you don't have a stocking this year because she's mad about it. She does have, she does, she does have a stocking, but we didn't put it out because it didn't match the other ones. She doesn't even know. She doesn't understand. You don't know. Yeah, here is the Miro Star other one that's lit up, except the bulb in the center is uh, burned out. But it's just, we have some other little things thrown on here. Um, I do have a couple other pieces that I haven't been able to put out uh, for one reason or another, but it's, this is pretty much the extent of our Christmas stuff. All right, so with that, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Yeah, so I will wrap it up here. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.